because even though Went Mitchell was from Louisville, Kentucky, he plays such quintessential New Orleans style that I think this instrument and the clarinet or simians belong in New Orleans. And I was working for a while with Tulane, but they sent me a donation form where they said they could sell the instruments if they needed to, and I didn't want to do that. Mm -hmm. And I think that the jazz museum that I'm donating it to has Ori's trombone. Oh, whoa. Yeah. Wow. So then they would have the front line. Oh, that'd be incredible. Yeah. Providing this is definitely, I mean, this is Simeon's clarinet, but, and I can't guarantee, but the, the scroll on the trumpet shows up in, the, in that picture of Jelly from, mm -hmm. the, from those 1926. Amazing. Yeah. So, anyway, this is Mitchell's horn. I got his death certificate in here, too. I met George Mitchell twice. I made a special trip to Chicago to see him. And um, it's a J, uh, this, uh, Oliver and Armstrong bought their instruments from the same maker. And I think he played a seven something, seven A Bach. Hmm. You, you, where's the trumpeter? You'll know more about that than I will. Sure. Would you be I, willing to let Gordon try and know sure, it Sure, right of course, now? yeah, certainly, yeah. I think it's marvelous that you guys are so interested in this heritage. You gonna play it? Yeah, let's see. You gotta, gotta get the valves unstuck. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, I guess. It has two rods, three rods for each valve instead of two. Mm -hmm. Which is really weird. Oh, okay. Maybe it's more stable. But this is leaking oil all over my hands. <laughs> that we do a little trio on the 1920s instruments.
alive. It's got some stank on it.